Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky is speaking out for the first time about agreeing to temporarily return lands to Russia in exchange for NATO membership. Such a solution would, according to Zelensky, lead to a ceasefire on Ukrainian terms. This is the first interview in which the Ukrainian president has spoken about a possible temporary relinquishment of lands currently controlled by Russia. So far, no one has offered us to join NATO. We should take the Ukrainian territory we have under our control, under the NATO umbrella, because even if there is a ceasefire, Putin will want to come back here. Zelensky believes that joining NATO would effectively help de-escalate the conflict, allowing his country and Russia to continue diplomatic negotiations over areas under Moscow's control. Zelensky gave the interview hours after Moscow launched another large-scale air attack. Ukrainian authorities said nearly 200 drones and missiles targeted infrastructure, disrupting power supplies to more than a million people. There is no light sometimes for several hours a day. I'm at work all day, but neighbors say there are more outages during the day. The darkness overwhelms me. The mood is sad, but we have to wait and believe. We live with hope, because it is much harder now for our soldiers on the front line. In previous years, especially in late fall, Russia has targeted energy facilities in Ukraine, aiming to deprive the civilian population of crucial heating and drinking water supplies during the harsh winter months and break the Ukrainian fighting spirit. The attacks are also aimed at undermining Ukraine's defense industry, which currently produces missiles, drones and armored vehicles, among other things.